So this marking on the pavement here, on the east side of the Great Pyramid, there are a wealth of these kind of markings all around the plateau. John Romer, the Egyptologist, says that there is a life-size blueprint of the Great Pyramid on this east side, a life-size blueprint. And I've, I've meant to check him out on that with some of his points. I haven't done that yet. So some of the marks that are on the east side here are meant to be a blueprint to keep the Great Pyramid to go up without becoming a corkscrew, to keep it straight. So I've interpreted some of these and actually presented at Egyptological conferences my findings. So I was studying this one the other day. This looks like really a circle here with a, a, a quadrant cut out from it. So what I did was I measured the angles here and then I, I put into Google Earth uh, where it is, its distance from the Great Pyramid and its distance from what's called the Widden cavity over there. So I know where this is so I can take it back to the house to uh, you know then find where it's pointing because it's my contention that that will point to somewhere meaningful right there and probably this line will too. And I've done this enough times, if that sounds silly or crazy to you, I've done this enough times to know it probably will. So uh, the other morning I was getting ready to do all that, setting it up on the computer after taking these measurements, getting ready to, and I then I had to leave. I was going with Roberto and Claire to the Red Sea and so I had to make provisions, get to get my stuff. And so then when we got to the Red Sea, taking a day away from our studies, just to relax a little bit. And Roberto came to me and he, he told me he wanted some help uh, in understanding a drawing he had been drawing his whole life since he was a boy. And the way he described it to me, it was like a quadrant that was part of a circle. So it was the very thing I had been studying that morning that he, without, without him knowing I was studying this. And so I still have it. Roberto is filming me right now. And so, Roberto, we're going to put this thing and, and I'll, you know, I'll let people know once we find out what it points to. But I'm saying I, I think this is probably going to point to somewhere meaningful inside the Great Pyramid. And this is going to point uh, who knows where. We'll line it up and see if it points to a pyramid or you know, where it goes. So the mysteries of Egypt.